Hey guys, it's Cameron here with Emerson House Buyers. Every week I bring you tools, tactics, strategies, lessons I've learned, things that I would do again, things I would never do and wish upon my worst enemy, and things that uh, you can learn from me that went well, didn't go well, um, things that you can mold and make your own fit your, fit your situation. And I also answer questions. So I got a great question, and it says, could you explain how you would scale this up referring to the BRRRR strategy to buy, rehab, rent, refinance, repeat, and continue rolling equity out of one deal into your next deal and the next deal. First of all, why am I qualified to talk about this? Well, I've used this strategy dozens, no, not a dozens, I would say more than a handful of times, excuse me, more than a handful of times to uh, pull equity out of my deals and be in full, be in buy a rental property with no money and actually getting paid at closing. So this is this is something I do fairly frequently. It's helped me build a sizable rental portfolio uh, in a little over a year uh, with over a dozen rentals. So, um, and I couldn't do that without this strategy. So I'm, I've used this quite a bit. Uh, how do you scale this up? This is a great question because it starts out, you know, you might do one deal and think, oh, this is great. or you know, have, have one investment property, but the real process to get it to scale is, is where you're going to be making your money. So how I do it. So I take, I buy a property. Let's look at the last one we did. So that one, um, bought it at 55, put 10,000 into it. It appraised at 133 and we pulled out 104,000. So that is what almost 40 grand pulled out of the deal you know you got you got some uh, lender fees in there and various other closing costs and what have you so we'll just say you pulled out 30 just to be very conservative so what did I do with that 30,000 so I took that 30,000 and buried it into marketing buried it into marketing and to use on the next rehab so how I got here's a little quick tip how I got in with my lenders is I said because they don't they want you to have some skin in the game I told them I would fund the repairs myself. So I took that 30 grand, I, fu I funded the repairs on the next deal, and then piled the rest into marketing. So I have not, I've been in business coming up on two years, 24 months, and I have not taken a dime out of the business. Every, every dollar, every single cent that the business makes, I turn around and plow it back into marketing. So how do you roll this into your next deal? You get paid at closing, they'll cut you a check for 20, 30, 40, whatever, maybe it's even 5,000 bucks, whatever it is. And then I use that, like I said, in the rehab for the next deal. Um, getting in good now with some, some lenders where I don't have to do that, we have a relationship. But I basically take that money and I plow it into marketing. And then, then you have a perpetual business that you have deal flow coming in and that's really what it's all about a lot of it's about deal flow so i i hope that answered your question if it didn't please clarify please clarify let me know exactly maybe some specifics on what you would like but that is that's how i do it it's it's not a complex process um and i have other videos about marketing if you guys want to check those out um, on how to market and uh and find your farm area and what have you but that's how I use it, and we just keep rolling. I've done two, I actually refinanced two properties at once. If you guys want to go into the, the Burr strategy a little bit deeper, let me know, please. I'm trying to help you guys out and uh, give you as much information as I can. So, um, again, hope that helped. If it did, share it with somebody. If it didn't, let me know what you guys would like or what other details you would like, how in depth you want me to go in this. And, um, and if you did, you know, let me know that as well. I appreciate it always. So, um, thanks, guys. See you next week. Keep, keep asking questions. Thank you.